Hello, all my little stars, and welcome back. Today, I'm gonna be drawing VTubers as cute little plushies. <laughs> uh, specifically, um, I have been playing around with the idea of possibly making these like um, a new redeem inspired by the great bird herself, Fane. <laughs> The great, beautiful bird lady herself, um, because I like her idea of, you know, uh, creating uh, little itty cute little like trinkets and stuff. And I'm like, well, I'm not really that, but I do like plushies and I do like cute plushie dolls. So instead, I'm going to turn you all into plushies. <laughs> so we're adding, we're adding to my, you can, you can become part of the plushie horde. <laughs> And I don't know where I'll end up putting them. Maybe maybe in a new background scene or setting or something like that. If I do that, uh, maybe I'll have them like in the back, just in a corner, you know? I'm not gonna be a monster. I'm not gonna nail them to the wall. Like apparently some other VTubers do. What? Why? Why? <laughs> Why do that? Um, so we're not gonna be doing that. We're just gonna be probably having them in a, in a nice little place. And the other thing is, is like, if I ever do streams where I'm like sleeping or something like that, I can just literally pull pull one up and uh, and cuddle with it, or I can add all of them. <laughs> it's just something fun. It's something cute and it's something adorable. So we're doing it with VTubers first because I want to do it with some VTubers because I actually do want to turn uh make some of them into like just fun little little things. You know what'd be funny though. What would be really funny is if some of the VTubers that have contacted me and being like, "Hey, can you can we can we actually get like a full design of actually this so that then we can actually turn it into into an actual plushie?" Sure, why the why the fuck not? <laughs> I don't think that ever happened, but that's funny if it would. Um. <clears throat> anywho, um, there's not really much to discuss or talk about other than um next week on monday we're gonna be starting the charity stream yeah i'm gonna be start i never stream on a monday but this time around i'm gonna be streaming on a monday um just to kick it all off for our april charity event um we're gonna be hosting it throughout the entirety of april streams will be normal meaning that it uh, streaming time will always be normal it will always keep being wednesday friday and saturday and every time that I stream, it will be the charity event. So we're just going to keep going throughout the month, throughout the entire month, just raising some money. I I don't know like how far we're going to go. There There is donation goals. I did put it on the Discord. I haven't put it up yet um, for Twitter. So that'll, that'll probably be happening soon. Um, but there are some incentives. Um, there's some fun ones and there's some, uh, fun goals and, and, and all of that. Um, my goal for it is to get up to 300, uh, by the end of the month. Uh, and if we do more than that, I will, I will just add goals. I, I don't know. <laughs> we'll just add goals for every hundred, you know, for every hundred after, after 300. So it's like, if we get up to 400, then I'll do this. If we get up to 500, I'll do this. Um... Maybe, maybe I'll have one where I have to play, I have to play, like, a Dark Souls, like, blindfolded or something. I don't know. No, we're not gonna do, we're not gonna do that. I'm not a Dark Souls player. <laughs> I'm not that insane. Um, but we'll do, we'll do something. We'll do something fun. Um, but at the end of the day, that's just how it is. <laughs> um, and there also is gonna be a new model debut, debut, and also, uh, George is getting a whole new look. That, that is the two key things. Uh, I will be showing off the silhouettes of those two looks uh, soon as well. Just because, might as well build some hype for it, right? <laughs> um, and and yeah, I think I think that's uh, I think that's pretty much it for for now. For now. <laughs> um. <clears throat> I will be like uh, talking about which uh, exactly VTubers I am doing, and I may like try and shout them out if I can uh, in the Discord, or not in the Discord, in the in the chat when I can. Um, so you can go check them all out as well. Um, of course, some of the ones I'm doing are, are basically some of my friends and colleagues, and other uh, one 
One is just because I can. Um, I will say I might do um, some of these in like waves as well. So there might be another one that I might do for like corporate VTubers as well, just for, for fun shits and giggles. Uh, but for right now, I'm just doing like VTubers I kind of know that I kind of want to do. And if this continues, maybe I might make it a little bit of like a, a, a thing to do. And maybe we can do like recommendations or something. I don't know. <laughs> um, oh, but yeah. <laughs> I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I, I, I never know what I'm doing, okay? That's just how it is. Um, but anyways, uh, I had to push back the stream an hour um, because I was playing Phasmo with a friend and uh, we did, we did finish uh, the Phasmo, um, the new Phasmo, the Phasmo event. We finished the Easter <laughs> Easter hunt event. That thing was terrible. That was awful. That was like the worst thing ever. I would say like the was it as bad as last year? Last year was worse. Um, because you had to find all the eggs, and this time around it was like you're an actual Easter egg hunt. Like you know, it, it, like you know, you have to actually like find, investigate things. Like you have to find all the. You have to follow the footprints of this like little itty bitty rabbit and all of that sort of stuff and it was fine um did we die a lot no actually surprisingly not but uh we there was a lot of hunts and it scared us <laughs> but we got it done and we just completed it so now we now we have brand new looks honestly i'm gonna be honest i still love phasmo but I feel like if you're not doing the challenges or anything like that and you're just like playing normally, I feel like after a while it gets really tiring, kind of kind of boring. Um, and 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 yeah, uh, I think I feel the same way when it comes to demonologist too, because after a while it just kind of gets a, a little meh. But um, I mean, if you're streaming it with a lot of people and friends and stuff like that, I think it's funnier. Um, but other than that, like, I think Phasmo, Phasmo and Demonologist are probably way funner to play with a lot of people. <laughs> Cause then you can, then, then you guys can all be like scared. <laughs> shared, scared fear together. Well, I mean, that's the point, isn't it? <laughs> Anyways. Uh, I'm gonna be switching over to stream so we can kind of get into this. Oh, but before before I do anything else, uh, if you are watching on YouTube, um, we are trying. Well, on Twitch and also YouTube, we're trying to get to 500 uh, followers and 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 subscribers. Um, so if you like the content, you want to see more of it, you can either come and lurk in the streams and have fun here. Um, and interact live, or you can just sit here, lurk, and just, I don't know, rack up points to make me do stupid shit. Um, <laughs> maybe even become a cute little plushie doll yourself. Um, or, you know, so VIP slots available. Um, or, uh, <laughs> you can chill out in the YouTube videos and just have fun and relax. I, I'm gonna be honest, I'm trying to get towards being able to have memberships and eventually open up super chats and all that sort of stuff. Um, that's like my goal is to move towards there so that then I can actually put some of the emotes that are here on Twitch over there um, so people can have fun with actually interacting more within the, the videos. And, and yeah, and moving in that direction. Because eventually, what I'm hoping for is being able to actually start hiring an editor at some point really later down the line where you're able to have a stable amount of money to where I can edit stuff and then be able to post it on the YouTubes. Because um, I'm going to be honest, I do not have all the time in the world. I am a singular person. I don't have a manager. I don't have anything. So the supporting and helping, it just pushed me out there. And it also makes sure that, um, well, you get to see my stuff again. So... Yee! Anyways, that all self-promotion aside, uh, let's get into the stream. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest, I'm a person that doesn't really like to self-promote, but unfortunately we're going to have to. But I will say, we have gotten to 350 uh, subs on the YouTube, which is really great. Um, 
It's also nice to see some love for the analog horror um, as well. I'm glad that that's doing well. Um, it's not like extremely to the levels I thought it would be, but I didn't expect much from it anyways. Um, the analog horror videos and that series, by the way, is on a little bit, going to be on a little bit of a hiatus. There are three videos out. I hope that satisfies you guys enough um, for right now. Um, but the reason being that it's on a little bit of a hiatus is because I'm trying to also get the comic done. So I'm trying to like do the comic, complete what I want with the comic, and then switch over to the analog core and kind of do more of that. Because um, they are supposed to be hand in hand with each other. A little bit. Mostly the analog core is going to be more important for the end of the comic. So yeah. Um kind of just like pushing it off a little bit to the side um because i'm like i want to get the comic done first uh so it is being taken a little bit back seat but when i can i will be working on like a video here and there for the analog series um there might be things i might be posted up in the youtube community tab so always look at that there might be something there um unless it's me just announcing stuff uh but for the most part it might be me actually like doing other stuff but eventually i have been thinking about it of maybe doing a stream here and there on youtube but i don't want to do it yet until i can open up like the ability of members and super chats and all of that sort of stuff because i want i want you guys to have fun in in the youtube uh streams as well and the other reason being is because the reason i want membership streams is sometimes i want to talk about certain things or like showing off the analog horror or maybe showing more behind the scenes of the comic and all that sort of stuff and i kind of want to like have that first behind like the membership stuff and then if i really want to then i will release it to the public or like you know for everyone else to see right um but you guys could get like more interesting stuff right so <laughs> and the other thing is i've been thinking about playing some certain games and the thing is i don't feel well to play those just on regular twitch stream and i'm thinking putting it behind a membership only stream might be a little bit better um just just because um i don't know i just <laughs> Um, but, but yeah. Um, so that, that's pretty much it for, for the YouTube stuff. Now those are big plans. I don't know if it'll ever happen. Honestly, the one problem with YouTube and why it's so freaking hard to really be popular or like get to the point where you can get the memberships and super chats and all of that is what's really hard is the watch hours. And literally, if everybody watches, like, at least an hour of every video, we would probably, I would probably reach that very soon. <laughs> but the thing is, I don't want to force, it's, it's like, I don't want to force people to watch my stuff for like an hour, right? Um, but I'm going to be honest, that is the only way to, like, reach the... 3,000 public watch hours. Do you want to know how many I currently have? 500. The last time I checked. I'm not mad about anybody. I'm not mad at anybody that's watching. I'm not here to say any of that. It's mostly like, I look at my analytics and I'm just like, no wonder it's really hard uh, to be able to get to the point where you need to be on YouTube. And YouTube is really great if you already have a pretty big community. Uh, there's actually, what, Doki Bird, I think, did a pretty good uh, overview of how it is to be a VTuber and a content creator. Um, some of the stuff that they said was really great. Um, and actually, um, just just great all, all in general. Uh, <laughs> so if you want, if you want some advice, um, I would say go over to them. They also have a thing about being a corporate VTuber and an indie VTuber. Um, and it is uh, 10 times harder. <laughs> in, in a way, um, the reason being is because corporate VTubers, uh, when you come to collabs, uh, you just have a whole bunch of stuff. Hi, Pug. Hi, Pug. Um, when you come to corporate VTubing, you have, like, basically a team that helps you. Um, whereas with indie VTubing, you kind of have to, like, build your entire network yourself. But, like, over time, you build it. So, uh, like, currently I have basically my own little collab network that I have, right? 
um, where I collab with. Not only just like my friends offline, but also like other people. Um, so yeah. <laughs> hmm. Anyways. <laughs> I could talk about, like, a lot of different things. Um, <clears throat> but the thing that, like, is mainly talked about is really the two most important things within VTubing is networking, which I suck at. <laughs> I try my best. I, 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 sometimes I get into a fix where I do my best to try and network and stuff like that. And sometimes I'm just not great. Um... I do have a kind of irrational thing where it's like, I feel I need to collab. And by that, I mean kissing. <laughs> um, well, what I mean is I feel like I'm kind of like a burden. That's what's this all, what's this all about? Um, I, I, I was talking about like VTubing and stuff like that and that Doki Bird has a pretty good thing if you want to watch it like tip their tips and tricks opinions on like how um how VTubing works but they were like mainly also talking about like the difference between corporate VTubing and indie VTubing and also kind of the things that they did in order to be where they are now now be in mind that Doki Bird can confirm that she does have a team of people behind her so it's not just her so she has a manager that helps her out. Um, she has probably an editor, so a few editors, um, or an editor uh, to edit her videos and clip them down. Um, she probably has some other stuff going on and about. Um, and of course, you know, hiring artists and all of that sort of stuff. So she, she has much more of a team behind her. Um, Compared to very much smaller indie VTubers that basically do not have a team and because they cannot afford to pay for a team. <laughs> um, but yeah. Hi, Peppers. Um, but yeah. I was like talking about like future things I want to do down the road where eventually on YouTube and stuff I might do streams on YouTube. Um, I would say for the most part... The streams on YouTube might be a little bit more cozy or family friendly games where there and maybe some art stuff. Um, and then on 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 Twitch, we might have more of like the non family friendly, very much cursing. But I would even put I have to look at YouTube exactly how you have to act on live streams on YouTube because it is a different beast compared to regular Twitch. Um, so I have to check, like, can I curse? How much can I curse? Um, do I have to basically baby everything down? Um, so, so yeah. <laughs> also, um, you have to play a lot into YouTube algorithm, whereas on Twitch, you kind of just, like, be. <laughs> but anyways, I want to, I want to work on these cute little things. So... I have done some sketches um, to show off kind of an idea of what these are going to look like. Um, so of course we have the wonderful, beautiful Fane. <laughs> so uh, I did I did do Fanes. Uh, so this is the beautiful bird, bird lady. Um, I then did Rufus because I wanted to do the hat and stuff. Hat came out well, thankfully. Uh, and then I did Clacy. Because <laughs> I just wanted to do Glacy. <laughs> um, we are going to work on some other care, uh, some other people as well. I'm just going to sketch these out and then we'll go back and probably do some coloring on them. The reason being is because I just kind of want to sketch these ideas. Um, but eventually later down the line, these are going to be redeems. Or like a redeem where you can join the plushie horde. And so you can say, uh, you know, I, I, w I wish to join the horde and then I will draw you as a, a little plushie. It's not available right now. It's not a redeem that's available right now. Don't forget, Pug. Oh, wait, that's their model. <laughs> yeah, Pug, your, your model's already just a cute, cute little plushie guy. Oh, hold on a minute.
I'm meeting my mom for dinner later, so she would just give me the rundown. <laughs> That's why I want to just sketch today. We're just basically doing doodle sketches today. Um, that's the plan. Also, um, I don't know if I want to switch over to doing more game stuff instead of art related stuff because I honestly am like trying to really focus in on trying to make my comic. Also, good news, comic is uh, coming along. Uh, I am finally putting color down and then I began to slowly realize how much color I need to do. <laughs> Uh, huzzah, I know. Hmm. Wolf, I don't know if I want to do wolf in their wolf form or not. You know what? Ow! Huzzah. <laughs> yeah, I might, I might even add the plushy attack to include all of these little thing, all these little guys. <laughs> Because I feel like it would be funny. Hmm. Wolf, should I do yours in the form? You know what? I'm going to do it because I think it, it makes sense. Oh. I'm going to just like... I think it'll just be funny and adorable. But this is a uh, name wolf. Uh, yeah, your hair is asymmetrical, so we'll just we'll just leave it as is. brave mercenary captain. Uh, you will probably recognize these dolls for when I turned, uh, from when I turned uh, some Baldur's Gate 3 characters into little cute dolls. You know what? I'm not gonna do ears on you. You have your, your ears on top. I'm gonna be honest, I hate when people do like the 3D models where they have- I hate this. Why- why is it on some like VTuber, uh, some like rigor- ugh, like modelers for VTubers? They make the ear here, but they have ears up here. What's the point of the ear here? Doesn't make sense to me. If the ear is up there, why need ear down here? It just doesn't make sense to me. But they just want to do weird and funny things, don't they? There we go. <laughs> Little cute. Little cute one. Audio only? You talking about, uh, talking about the cat girls with human ears? Uh, yeah. Like where they where they make where they like do the they do the ears and then they're like oh, but then they have like human ears too and I'm just like why? It doesn't it doesn't make sense. <laughs> like why why do that? Double ear. Cringe. Exactly. Just d double ear doesn't look good to me. It just- it doesn't make sense, that's why. That's why I think it is.
Uh oh. My dog's second favorite person has arrived. There we go. I know puppers, you want, you just want to be friendly. All right, for the most part, his entire design is very much symmetrical, which is beautiful. By the way, if you ever want to know something about your VTuber design on whether or not people can draw it, if it's too complicated that I can't draw it, um, in a cute, chibier design. Uh, yeah, it's too complicated. And there's there's been a few times where I feel like some people have like really complicated designs. I'm just like, yeah, I'm not gonna draw that. That's uh, that's too much. So, if you're ever worried about knowing whether or not it's too complicated, that's the best way to tell. If you cannot, if you believe that you cannot draw it without, it's mostly like, can you draw it but still keep some of the understanding of what it is? Like people can still identify, yeah, that's totally this, insert this character, right? Oh, an ad is going to start soon. Uh, yeah. But it's more of like, if you cannot tell that this character is this character, then you are not doing it effectively. You, you have a difficult design. And the one thing is, is if you want people to be able to draw you, do not draw a difficult design. What is VIP for anyways? VIP is just like, you get a cool, fun badge. That's all it is. You just get- it's some people just like collecting cool, fun little badges. That's it. Um... Oh, you wanna be VIP? Uh, I forgot how to make a person VIP, so I'll do it after stream. Let me- let me write you down on the list. <laughs> Yeah. By the way, you don't get like any benefits or anything like that. I don't know why they have like the VIP thing when it doesn't really like do much. Like, <laughs> just sounded funny. Yeah. You 
good puppies? Uh, yeah, it does have really good puppies. I will say this much. I just I, I wish that VIP just gave you more than like a cool little little thing, you know? Cause like cool, you get a VIP thing, but what does it exactly do? Is that it? Is that all it does? It's like Yep, that's, that's all it does. Just gives you a cool little uh little thing and that's it. There we go. Alright, Nightwolf is done. <laughs> At least the sketch is done. Because I will go back and do colors and stuff. I don't know if I'll do like a whole lot of stuff. But, yeah. Also, uh, this is uh, Senner. Uh, they, <laughs> they are another deity VTuber. I, I will say, I haven't like done much with Center. I've like met them like a few times. They're really fun. They're really awesome. And and yeah. And for so and for once in my life I finally found somebody that also has watched Skate the Infinity. <laughs> I don't know where the Skate in the Infinity fandom has gone, but it like or at least people that have watched it. You get to have the fancy table behind the curtain. It smells like expensive perfumes. Yeah, that's that's the VIP section for the for the for stuff. I I do wish, like, that people. I I do wish, in a way, that it could be more than just a cool little badge. Um, and by the way, like, um, for the most part, with VIPs and how I look at VIP. VIP people because the thing is is like cool you saved up the money to like get a VIP I'm talking about the whale bath pet fume baby oh my god no <laughs> we're not doing the whale whale barf perfume oh my gosh hello hello fame oh wait hold on Hello. Hello. <laughs> America, yeah. <laughs> you're cute. You're 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 the first to be added to the to the to my plushy horde. Why are you do my <laughs> so good? <laughs> because because I do. <laughs> Uh, it was inspired a little bit by how you have the draw draw me like your trinkets and I made this little fun base the brows I know <laughs> I had to I had to make you look like you're ready hi fame I was just bragging about my expensive perfume George um <laughs> Uh, we do have we do have some others it's mine now oh my gosh yeah but i was inspired by your stuff because eventually i wanted to make like something fun like this so so yeah we have rufus as well i love them i saw the the Baldur's gate 3 one yeah it's basically i had that base and i was like you know what i should probably use it for other things so we have we have rufus we have glacy I did I did I did the garlic boy because I had to do garlic I had to do the garlic boy. <laughs> I couldn't not do garlic boy. The full gang. Uh no 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 we can't we can't forget wolf. <laughs> we can't forget wolf. <laughs> so, so yeah. <laughs> I'm just basically sketching these out and then I'll color them later. I love them all. I I do too. They're so cute. They're so adorable. And I'm working on center now. Uh, and then we have this is just another uh, kind of YouTuber acquaintance I made and I was like, you know what? I really like his design, but I've never drawn his design before. So I was like, you know what? Let me draw it in tribute form. That'll be easier. <laughs> 
<laughs> Hot Prego man, yes. Uh, and then I was like, you know what? We don't. We have. We have too many. We have too many men. I'll do Gloria. <laughs> crocodile. Yes, he is a croc. He. I. Yeah, he's a crocodile. I think. I. B I believe so. Don't forget your your shield. I didn't need his number. Oh my god. Okay, let me let me get. Don't, don't forget yourself. Oh, you want me to draw myself? You want me to draw cute, cute little art? <laughs> we, yeah? Okay, you know what? Maybe, okay, center, we're putting you on hold. We're drawing me. <laughs> I guess I would balance it out, right? Poor center. I'm sorry, center. I love you. <laughs> I love you, Center. <laughs> Don't forget, George. George, you're not getting done. You're already cute and adorable. <laughs> oh, I forgot to... I can draw myself so easily. There is never enough, George. I I know there is never enough, George, but I'm sorry, George, you're gonna you're gonna have to be left on, on your lonesome. Sorry, George. That's just how it is. It's how it be. I apologize, George, in advance. Actually, there's somebody else that draws like little little chibis of me very cutely, and I love them. It's actually one of my friends. Cause they how they draw me is so is so cute. It's a it's it's so adorable. Every time I see them, I just I just melt. My heart melts. Of course, can't can't forget my my little. Honestly, I don't know what it is. I, a mole, a freckle. I I I've given up on trying to figure out what it is. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest. And you might be like, oh, it must, it has, it has to be like a, a mole, a, a, a mole or something. The funny thing is, is like, that my little mole here is literally just a representation of how I have freckles. So, I just like it because it has a freckle. It's like a good representation of my, of my freckles. Funny enough, actually, on my other eye, over on this eye, I actually do have a little freckle, but it's on- it's over here instead. So it's basically mirrored on the wrong side. Which is kind of funny. You know, I've done so many drawings of myself that sometimes I forget that I have I have boots. I'm not even joking. I literally forget in my design that I have boots. And then I go, "Oh yeah, I forgot. I have I, I have boots." 
I have boots, and yet I still forget that I have them. There you go, Fane. There you go. I had to make sure I did it quick so then if you need to go sleepy sleeps, that it's done. There <laughs> you go. <laughs> the goddess herself, I know. <laughs> I, I was almost like debating, I'm like, should I do it with my 2.0 design? I'm like, no! <laughs> Ow. Have you considered pause instead? Pause? Uh, no. Um, <laughs> And extra woman. Yes, extra woman. Now we can do setter. <laughs> for, for setter. <laughs> I'm sorry, setter. Um, setter has a lot of asymmetricalness to their design. And I mean mostly in their clothes. Yeah, so what? Now we got like three girls and the rest are dudes. I- why is it? I don't know why this is, but I find much more fun and enjoyment um, with just other VTubers that are just as chaotic as me. And I feel like the char the people that are just as chaotic as me most of the time sometimes are also mostly dudes. Which is funny. Not to say, because Fane over here, you and I, same brain cell here. Same brain cell. <laughs> but. <laughs> just one. Yeah, just one brain cell that we share. No, no. You know what? With all of us, we just share one brain cell together, okay? <laughs> with the entire group. I like to share it with you. Aww, I I love sh I love sharing the brain cell with you as well. <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> you thinking too hard about it? No, no, we don't. We, no, the thing is, we don't think. <laughs> There's. <clears throat> we we don't think at all. That's 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 the point. <laughs> the point of trying to share it i will say my brain cell was working very nicely this morning though because i decided to do the phasmophobia uh easter egg event i finished it with my friend literally this morning that's why i pushed that's why i pushed stream back an hour that <laughs> brain cell is doing overtime it has to i mean that's just how it is that's just how it is Okay, center, I'm gonna go with red for you as well. Oh. I just realized that a lot of these faces, if anybody remembers, um... Well, if anyone knows, um... Uh... I'm trying to think. If anyone knows, um... Ah, oh, I'm trying to remember! Uh, Animal Crossing! Yeah, the face is inspired a lot by Animal Crossing. Like how I do it is inspired a lot by Animal Crossing. I have to brain cells. I make them kiss. <laughs> yes, you can make them brain cells kiss apparently. But I'm gonna be doing this, like, sketching stuff, because the only- the reason being is because I actually do have to... I have plans after Steam. I'm gonna try, and to the best of my abilities, make, uh, centers, um, tattoos here. They're tattoos, correct? Am I wrong? Uh, no, they're more like, hold on. They are now? <laughs> Did you think I would be responsible with them? Responsible with what, George? You're not responsible with anything. I'm trying to like, make sure I can accurately depict them. 
It's a it's a beard. <laughs> oh, I don't I don't think Setter would would find that. <laughs> go go and tell Setter that their tattoos are a beard. No, no, don't 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 say that. But <laughs> brain cells art. I know. Brain cells. What are those? I don't need them. I actually think this is the first time I've ever drawn center. May I see mine again? Yeah, sure. <laughs> you would like to see yours again, little Fane. You know what the funny thing is, Fane? I could literally draw a picture. Oh yes, excellent. <laughs> Are you taking a picture, Fane? Are you taking a picture of this right now? Wait, what? Wait, why are you putting my, why are you putting my link? <laughs> Can you make the mouth more more V? That yeah, I was thinking about that. <laughs> oh, I'm summoning. <laughs> you have to. You must summon them. Of course, you must. I'm sure it's not that oh. <laughs> All right, all right. <laughs> there we go. I placed your link here instead of his DM. <laughs> hey, it happens. It happens to us, you know. Happens to the best of us. There you go. That's that's the bird. Hello, Rufus. Or should I say, little t doll Rufus? <laughs> sniff, sniff. What what are you sniffing? There's nothing here. <laughs> There's nothing here for you to sniff. I thought a good one. It smells like that. <laughs> Aw, yes. I will say I am planning on doing um the <laughs> I will say I am planning on doing more VTubers. Uh and the people I am going to do is probably like I like how you use his trinket and not his actual model. <laughs> no, I actually not only did I use this, I actually also used the picture that I drew. <laughs> As a reference, it's just not here because I pulled it up on a different screen. I do the same stuff. Yeah, see, Rufus does the same. <laughs> oh my gosh. We all work hard. Yes, we do, Fane. We do work hard. <laughs> we all do work hard here. Yeah. Has glasses. Oh, there's there's my hair back. There we go. Got it back. <laughs> uh, and then we got Wolf, and then we got little cute me, and then we're working on center. Crab. Yes. I will say I've always had a difficult time drawing crab hands or like little crab claws. Um. I've done- I'm done playing Animal Crossing. Now I can get- oh my gosh. Um, perfect fun. <laughs> lurk. Okay, thank you for the Lurk Fane. I hope that you have a good time. But now we're- we're working on, uh, the wonderful, amazing center. Wrong color. I just like working on some people that I just either have wanted to draw or haven't been able to. So, if anything, this is like a great way to kind of draw a bunch of VTubers in just a cute, little adorable way. 
And I am going to be making this a redeem so that then people like in the stream can also become it. Um, could be become these cute little little guys. They're just cute little guys. <laughs> At the end of the day, they're just cute. They're just cute little 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 guys. Um. Okay, that's kind of evened out. Same. I'm just gonna draw the uh the tattoos here just to make sure that I'm doing it correctly. All right, and then there's another one here. I don't know if I can get all the detail of them, but I will do my best. The more the more complicated you make they make your designs, the the harder it will be for me to translate it into cute little chibis. And actually, the best way that you can tell if your design is really nice is, like, someone was saying how like a good way to test if your design is really cute and and strong, and also just you should check if it's easy for you to draw. <laughs> is if you can just turn them into a chibi. And somebody, this one person actually ch does do the model as like a little chibi, as like a reference, and then they build it as the bigger model. Because then they know like kind of the main points that they want to uh, highlight with the uh, with the stuff, which is actually a good idea. Gotta make sure that their hair is coming down here. There we go. And then, I don't know if I can do that tattoo correctly, but we shall, we shall try. I apparently am not doing it right. I'm trying my best. I try my best. We, we work hard. There you go. <laughs> so there's a lot of so there's a lot of tattoos, okay? I'm not I'm not great at drawing tattoos. I thought tattoo would translate well. What? You're drawing, you're drawing a drawing in a drawing. I mean, I guess so. I mean, you're not, you're not completely wrong, Pug. I am drawing a drawing inside of a drawing. Oh, these are, this is shorter. I hope this is done well <laughs> for setting. Uh, how many of these? One, two, three, four, five. Okay. So one, two, three, four, five. Right. And then how many are here? One, two, three. Four, five, six. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. There we go. Perfect. 
I'm just drawing them like this right now, just to keep it simplistic. Hooray! And then and I did it. I did it. I did it. <laughs> we got setter. Hooray! No, I, I'm gonna be honest, I I have wanted to draw uh, center, I just haven't had like the time to really dedicate anything and I'm like, let me draw an acute chibi. <laughs> and honestly, chibi is a little bit harder because you have to keep all these elements still the same, but still be able to be readable. Um, thankfully, I mean, you know, with the tattoos and everything and how the silhouette is, it still reads like center at least. And that's what's important. <laughs> Oh, I forgot to put the little thing on there, on their, like, uh, on their little shoes here. I'm just gonna call them shoes. There you go. Hooray. Right. All right, now, <laughs> now we're gonna work on this guy. <laughs> this is a uh, Gangla. Uh, he is a uh, crocodile. Oh, he's a gator VTuber. So I think he's an alligator um, VTuber. Um, he's pretty fun. Uh, if you do watch his streams, he has a uh, picture of. Uh, a cosplay Leon Kel Kennedy that's in the top right corner or top left corner that has been there for two years apparently. Uh, it is really funny and he's never removed it so he just keeps it there. <laughs> so if you want to see his streams you can have fun with that and just seeing a nice picture of <laughs> Leon Kennedy a uh, Leon Kennedy cosplayer and it's just <laughs> it's funny. He's he is a funny guy. Um uh, he's actually going to be doing a donathon soon um, to raise some money so that he can have his mom and grandma go on a trip. And so, yeah, I'd say go and uh, go and have fun in his streams. And and I hope that he reaches his goal. I I do. We may raid him sometimes when he's doing it. So. Uh, anyways, I'm gonna I'm gonna get I'm gonna I'm gonna get up and do a stretch. Everyone get up. We're doing stretches right now. <laughs> I say as my face my my face is like tracking is like breaking. But I've sat here like all day since this morning, so like I need to stretch. I don't care if everything breaks as long as I stretch. That's what's important. There we go. All right. <laughs> We're all good now. I mean, there's still some like creaks in my back, but. Oh, and the ad. Ad is playing. You know what? Now I'll, I'll, I'll do it when I can like do another ad again and I'll, and I'll go to the bathroom. <laughs> well, I'll start sketching this. I need to put this into a folder. His eyes. What are his normal eyes? Okay. I'm trying to still make him like 
gator like. I still want to like keep a lot of his uh, gatorish design elements. to keep some of his patches correct. I need his number? <laughs> okay, hold on, hold on. Let me get his Twitch. Let me get his Twitch, okay? I'll, I'll, I'll send you it, okay? I actually, I actually kind of do, uh, I, I, I don't know. Name? Hold on. I'm getting it. I'm getting it for you. Actually, wait, hold on. I like I like some stuff on his Twitter. I'll 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 I'll, I'll get that. <laughs> That's the easier way to go. Uh The twi the Twitter's easier. Uh da 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 da. Where shh! I'm getting it! I'm getting it as fast. Oh my gosh, there's so many boot hill. Oh my god, I just need I need the other thing. There's so much boot hill. <laughs> I totally don't have a problem. I totally don't have a problem. No, I'm not joking. There's so many things I've liked for boot hill art. I'm sorry. <laughs> I have, I don't have a problem. <laughs> Where the heck did I put it? I think I reposted it, so I think maybe it'll just be- Oh my god. That can't be that far. It shouldn't be. There it is. I found him. I found him! He is an alligator! Alright, let me- let me see. I'm getting it! I'm getting it! There you go. <laughs> he plays a lot of different games. I'm honestly surprised he hasn't made it to Twitch Partner. Because he's pretty funny. But most of the times when he streams is like later on at night. Which is sometimes kind of hard for me to watch. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Uh, and, and you know what? Just, just for you, just for you. Also, here's his Twitter. <laughs> you can go sock him on Twitter. Um, he is doing a, uh, donathon. Um, and a, I think it's March 31st. It is an uncapped donathon. Um, and he's just, he's having, he's gonna be doing a, um, some fun stuff. Yeah, he's raising money for his mom and his grandma to go on a vacation together. Because uh, his grandma is dealing with some health issues. Or there's there's something going on. Um, honestly, I try and not divul I try and not go into it too much. Um, they said other things about it. And they just want to do something nice for their family. And, and yeah, he's pretty cool like that. I'm going to be honest. If I ever get dead by daylight and stuff like that. <laughs> I was either gonna hit him up or somebody else and be like, hey, teach me Dead by Daylight. I don't know shit. <laughs> teach me. <laughs> I, I am but I am but small child. Actually, I was thinking of hitting up Center and probably Rufus and Sin, because uh when I start when I start going into Elden Ring more, when I get a better PC, I'm gonna need help. <laughs> I'm gonna need help with that. <laughs> I'm just wee baby that knows nothing about about that kind of stuff. I am just wee child <laughs> in the world of Elden Ring. Yeah. <laughs> 
Just wee wee little baby art in 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 Elden Ring. That's probably what I should call new pl new plays. I will say this much: if I ever play any Dark Souls games, it's gonna be called Noob vs Elden Noob vs Dark Souls <laughs> because I've never played a Dark Souls game. <laughs> I will say, I have, like, kind of understand how to play a Dark Souls game, but I've never, like, actually outright gone out of my way to play a Dark Souls game, you know? And then I'm just like trying to like, I've never drawn him either. So I'm like trying to like, oh, that isn't what I wanted. <laughs> I'm trying to like make sure that it's correct. All the, by the way, on the YouTube, I am going to link everybody's thing. So everyone knows which one we're doing it. And I'll do it in order. I'll even put like time. I'll try and like put things in the timeline or something if I can remember um, at what times. Okay, so... Okay, his hair kind of weird. <laughs> his hair a little weird. Alright, so then he has like his hair kind of go out like that, but then it like kind of comes down like this. I'm like, I'm like trying to figure out how this hair is supposed to be. <laughs> Okay, I'll just deal with that for right now. Oh. It's saving. There you go. And then he kind of has his hair going out like that. Uh, okay. <clears throat> Oh, apparently, this guy did get into some, I would say, stupid um, controversies. I, I mean, not controversies. I mean, like, he kind of... Honestly, I've been thinking about doing this, too, when, for my two, for my male 2.0. Because, yes, there will be a male 2.0 along with the female. It's just the female will be debuted first, and then the male one will come later. Um, <clears throat> but he was kind of talking about how... Um, here, I'm going to make his, his muscles, because we gotta, we got to make sure we capture that correctly. There we go. I'll make him, I gotta make him buff. All right, him, that and all that will be fine. Um, but he was saying how on, on stream, he, uh, you can remove his shirt, but he has like no nips. And some people were like, what? But you have to have that. And I'm just like, no, he doesn't have to if he doesn't want to. Um. And the other thing is, like, he's supposed to be a reptile. Reptiles don't have that because they're not, they're, they they just lay eggs. So it makes more sense for him to not have it than have it. And the other thing is, you can always draw it in the art if you want to do it that way. Like, some people don't mind that. I don't mind that. But... Like, people were, like, kind of getting mad at him and saying, like, no, but you should have this sort of stuff. And it's like, hey, it's up to them. It is the it is the VTuber's decision on whether or not they want to, to have that. So I'm on his side. I'm like, it, it is up to you. It's your decision. I have it on my mail just because I wanted to put it on there. But for my 2.0, I might take it off. And the other thing is, I don't know if it's safe on Twitch anymore to really have it. That's why I even removed the ability to remove his shirt um, for my male model is because of that. Because I don't know. I don't know if it's okay or not anymore. 
So, but I kind of hate that people are kind of bad-ish at him because he just was like, I made the decision to not have it because I just didn't want to. And also just didn't make sense for the design. And I'm like, yeah, you do it because you want to do it. And no one else can tell you otherwise. Oh, uh, his, his thing does not do that. Okay, hold on. It's like this. Can you make this? I'm just gonna do that. Uh, hold on. I'm like trying to... Figure out. So, this, and then... And then this. <clears throat> and then this. I think at the end of the day, as long as you're happy with the design that you have, that's all that matters. And I'm gonna be honest, like, even with like, even with this design that I have, my model, I honestly still adore my- I, I, I'm gonna adore my 2.0 a lot more because I feel like- I feel like personally with my design, that's what I wanted to go for and I just didn't think I had the energy or ability to really do it because I thought that it would be too crazy. Uh, and now actually being able to do it, I'm just like, I'm so happy that I can do it. Uh, because of the weight of how his... I don't think you're gonna... Oh, mm. oh no. I feel like I won't be able to fully achieve some of the stuff of how he looks, but it's okay. As long as I wrap these bandages around his hands, I think it will be fine. Possibly. Sometimes I have to sacrifice certain things in order to make the design look accurate. <laughs> and then and then yeah i i'm sorry i can't draw his 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 legs very well <laughs> I will say this much, if 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 Gangwa ever sees this, I'm just gonna be like, I'm sorry dude. I your your design is very hard to actually make it to it's a shibby sometimes. I applaud whoever makes your emotes, man. <laughs> I think he does, but I don't recall. I might be wrong. I doth not recall, sir. Um all right, we gotta get your tail going. <laughs> Later, bye pug. Okay, do 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 do. There you go. I'm gonna I'm gonna fix his little his his little legs. His little legs look look so derpy. I'm gonna try and do them better. Oh, now they just look worse. Does is this better or worse?
I don't know. I think I think it looks better. I I it could it could be better, it could be worse. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> but <laughs> I did <need> it. <laughs> oh, his little tail. I like his tail. I like, I'm gonna be honest, I like drawing VTubers that have more animalistic parts to them. Because I, I just think that there's more creativity which what you can do. Um, I think that's why, again, I like my 2.0 a little bit. It's not too crazy. My 2.0 isn't too crazy. Um, but I'm if I do do a rebrush on it, like later down the line, I might add like more to the design. But who knows? Who knows? All right. Who's the last person? Last person is Gloria. We're just doing the sketches, by the way, today. I just wanted to sketch them out. There's no coloring that's going to be happening unless I want to do that. Um, but honestly, my back's kind of like really hurting very bad today. I woke up like with a really bad backache. Um, so I'm probably not going to be doing um, everything that I wish to do. Um, so what we might do is we might continue with these uh, next week um, as kind of the plan. I do have a plan to maybe also draw some of the lore comic characters and like who we're going to be like looking at. And honestly, it's not that much of a of like spoilers and stuff. It's just like I've already drawn these characters before like multiple times. So I just want to draw like them for fun shits and giggles, you know? Um, I'm either gonna draw like a few of them together, like in a group photo or like have a full group photo. I don't know. I don't know what I want to do. I just know that I might draw that. Um, but it depends cause I think next week I kind of want to start doing more game related stuff than doing like art related stuff. So sometimes I get into a fix of doing a lot of art. And then other times I want to do less art and more, um, and more games. And I honestly just want to do some more, like, cozier games. So we might go between, like, Sun Sunhaven and Stardew. Because I want to still continue playing in, in Stardew. But I also want to show off Sunhaven a little bit. Because Sunhaven is, like, kind of cool and interesting. Because it's basically a little bit like Stardew. Um... But a lot better in my opinion. <laughs> Cause I don't have to deal with the freaking energy bar. I have such beef with an with with a freaking stamina bar. And I, I, I don't know why I have such beef with it. I just do. No, Gloria is more of like purples and stuff. So let's get her out with more purples. Oh, more pinks actually. There you go. Uh I'm gonna be honest, these are more of like VTubers that I know than people that I watch. But I do want to do some of like other, um, uh, of like corporate, or like some corporate VTubers. But the people that I'm planning on doing are like smaller, like smaller corporate ones. And the reason I say smaller corporate is because these, uh, particular, because I, I really started liking, um, the um i'm trying to remember their names <laughs> i like first stage production i think that they're really cool and they're really neat and more people should know about them because <laughs> I, I they are on youtube um but i don't think that a lot of people really know much about them and so that's why i'm just like i i want to make sure 
that people know about them. Because they're cool. And they they can either be really cozy, or some are really crazy insane. And, and yeah. I just realized that Gloria's hair kind of looks like the, uh, the un- the- the- <laughs> the unkept, um... <laughs> Sorry I'm saying about the, this about Gloria, but it kind of looks like, you know, in, uh... When it's been really long, and you haven't, like, played, uh, in- You haven't played your, uh, your g the- you're, you're, you haven't played uh, Animal Crossing in a really long time, and so you get that really bad bed head. Why does Gloria's kind of hairstyle feel like that? I'm so sorry, Gloria. I love you. I love you, Gloria. But it kind of feels like that. I'm sorry. It just, it just kind of does. I'm sorry. Oh my goodness. Okay, Gloria does have a little tail as well. I just want to make sure. And then I need her little little thing. And then she kind of has her hair. Oh no, Gloria, your 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 hair is too too big apparently. It's like that, and then it kind of goes down like that. Perfect. <laughs> oh, Gloria. Oh, I I did an oopsie. I did a very big oopsie. Uh, this is drawn on the same layer because I hate this. Sometimes I'll click on add new layer and it doesn't add a new layer. We're just gonna keep this. We're just gonna keep this. I don't care. I'm not redrawing this. <laughs> it doesn't matter anyways. It's not like it's not like it's it's the end of the world anyways. It just doesn't mean I can remove it when I'm showing off the stuff, but it's okay. I'll just- I'm gonna just have- the, post these up as whips anyways, so. Yeah, I do want to do more artwork of uh, my 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 Oshis in in first stage production because I'm gonna be honest, I think that they're really cool. And again, I don't think that a lot of people really know about them, which is kind of sad because they're really cool. Uh, yeah. And then I like that. Like that. Okay, uh, those sleeves start the same, but they end differently. And then... There we go. For the time being, oh, that should work. And then I need... Change that. And then... So, 
Hair's thing kind of goes like that, and then like, like that. And then this continues. here kind of have your thing going like that and then over here you kind of just have it more further back You still have gloves on both sides. Alright. And then... I'm like trying to like think. <laughs> uh, Gloria, you have so much... You don't have a lot going on, but it is more difficult when you're trying to make it uh, be somewhat accurately relevant to the design in a whole. Draw them. Try my best. I do try my best. There we go. I think that's the best I can do for right now. Oh, yeah, and then you have your bow up here. is starting. I think I'm gonna go and take a little break and then I will debate on what I want to do next. I might just post these up as sketches but I might like do another sketch before we go. Um, but I'm gonna BRB.
I hope you all enjoyed that small little break. <laughs> Um, but yeah, <laughs> uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be honest, I, I'm really tired. <laughs> I think I've been getting, this is why I kind of want to take a break from drawings for the most part is because I'm starting to like get a little bit burnt out from it. Um, cause I've just been coming, be, been becoming more and more and more and more tired. And like, I've been kind of repulsed to do drawings some for the most part. Um, but I did want to sketch something fun. Um, something outside of the normality of things, right? Um, compared to what I have been drawing. So that's why I was like, let me just do this. Or let me do like funny doodles or stuff like that. Um, so yeah. So I'm gonna probably take these and make them like all little whips, um, and 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 and, and just have fun. <laughs> I could refine them more, but I don't want to. What's the fun in that? <laughs> But, but yeah, so that's, I think, I think that's what I might do. I'm sorry if I'm getting tired. I'm just like, <clears throat> it's just like, I, I don't know. It's like, I'm getting, I'm getting to that two, two, th two to four uh, o'clock uh, slump in the day where I just kind of want to like decompress a little bit and just kind of be on my own. Um, so yeah, I, I, I'm not surprised. I figured that this was going to be a short stream anyways. Uh, cause sometimes I just like these shorter streams and a lot of people might be like, oh, shorter streams are not good for your engagement. It's like, Hey, sometimes you need to take shorter streams. Sometimes you can't keep streaming. Um, so I think that's what I'm going to do. That seems like the best decision for me right now. Cause I don't want to keep pushing myself when I don't feel like doing it. Um, so I'm going to save these. I'll probably post them out in like a full little picture book later. Um, because I kind of don't want to do that live. So I'll do it like literally right after. <laughs> so let me, let me save. Um, and then we are going, I'm going to do this. And I'm going to do that. Oh, it did, it did not register that. There we go. <laughs> Off to the side. Booga, 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 booga. <laughs> um, I move around. I move around a lot. Um, but yeah. Um, so I might just talk about some new stuff instead. Um, actually, what I could do is pull up um, something fun for you guys to look at. Um, maybe I will. Just for just for shits and giggles. It might be big. It might be large. Uh, or you know what? I can put it in. Put it in the little announcements over here. Let me just, let me just add. Oh, I meant to, I meant I wanted to add something. Add. Add a file. Let's go over to. It's something fun for the charity event. So let me just like show off a little bit of the incentives. Um, because we actually do have full incentives. Um, so let me just get over to it. Oh, did, did not. There it is. Let me stop. Oh! Ah. Okay, hold on. Let me just, let me, I, I need to push, push the pause button, not the stop button. There we go. Um, <laughs> so here, uh, so for the charity event that we're going to be having in, um, in, in April, uh, for the entire month, uh, here are some of the things that are some little donation incentives. Um, now the thing is about the eating salt one, um, it will be a small handful of salt. And I mean like small, it's not going to be a whole lot. Okay. Um, and when I mean small, I mean like probably barely enough to fill it like a teaspoon. Okay. The reason being is because I found out that if you ingest way too much salt in a certain period of time, 
Uh, it will not be good for your body, and I may have to go to the hospital. Uh, I do not want to do that. I want to be safe, so we will not be doing that. Um... And it'll just be like with a regular old fashioned table salt, by the way. Um, so it's not it's not anything like too crazy of a salt, you know. It's not like I'm doing it with like le uh, like you know lemon salt or something like that, or Himalayan salt, which has a higher sodium content. I know that if I ever go to the doctors and they look at my blood work and they see it, and they're gonna just be like, "What the heck happened in like this time?" And it's like, um, yeah. So <laughs> I had a bunch of salt on stream for charity. <laughs> Um, but some of the incentives that we do have, uh, I will do a froggy sketch of you. It'll be like a quick little froggy sketch, um, for a dollar. For five dollars, I will do a five minute sketch. And here's like an idea of a five minute sketch. Um, for ten dollars, you will get a personalized digital signed Polaroid by me. Or you can choose to have it by George, um, and George will sign it. Um, like there, it's hard to see, but George does have a little signature there. Um, and then for a hundred dollars, you will make me eat salt. There's a bunch of also, uh, different donation goals that we're going to be doing as well. Um, I will be posting this up eventually alongside that of the donation goals. Um, so that you guys can have, can have some fun with that. Um, and, and, and just get hyped and prepared for it. Uh, again, I will be debuting a new model. Um... It's going to be fun. Um, and George is also going to be getting basically a new look as well. It It is going to be a little bit funny with how it's set up, by the way. Um, there is there is a purposeful reason to why certain things are set up the way that they are. Um, so don't be don't be all in sh like going like, what the heck is going on? Uh, this is just how it is. Um, and again, we'll be kicking this off on April 1st. I will reiterate it uh, as we get closer to it um, for when it will be done. But uh, but yeah, I am going to actually move my drawing tablet aside. Because how I have it set up, I'm going to be honest, um, when I get my new PC set up and all of that, I might have a better place to be able to set all of my stuff around. And that'll just make it easier for me to, uh, to really get the stuff done that I need to do. I will say, because it was a shorter stream, there isn't really that much to clip, unfortunately. <laughs> but hey, you know what? That's just how it be. Sometimes you're not going to get a clip from a stream. That's just how it be. Maybe I'll look through it later. I'll, I'll identify it later. Um... That's something I want to do. Um, but tomorrow, we are going to be playing some more Stardew tomorrow. Um, <laughs> uh, that also might be a short stream, depending on things. But I do want to get a... I do want to play a new game um, next week. And that's why I'm probably going to be switching over to doing more games. Um, it's just having more fun with games. Um, but there is a new game that I saw that's called like Supermarket Simulator that I kind of want to play. Um, I think it's fun and it might be cozy and all of that sort of stuff and just have fun with. Um, we may be also bringing back Hades, the Hades series, um, cause we still have to finish that. And, uh, also we have Stardew and all that. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to be bringing Monster Hunter back. Um, we'll, I will see about that. Um, but we might slowly be moving away from doing games and slowly moving towards doing, um, uh, slowly moving away from doing art and kind of taking a break from it on streams and stuff like that and kind of be moving more into doing games and stuff like that because that's kind of just how I want it. All right. And then this. Yeah. I just want to like, oh, wait, yes, no, sorry, I'm like, I'm like getting stuff together. I'm writing stuff down of what I need to get done. Also, I will say, um, next week we might be working on something that I, I've been 
thinking about possibly streaming, but I might actually not stream it. But there is like a uh, a thing I'm I'm doing on the side that I'm gonna be honest. I don't know if I'll finish it in time. I hope I do. I hope I finish it in time because that'll be awesome. But you never know. But yeah, I do I do hope that you've enjoyed this a little bit. And you know what I was also thinking is that maybe next week also doing just a just chatting stream. And I'll I'll have something together for the just chatting stream. But I'm trying to see right now. Oh. <laughs> I know someone we can raid. That I I rarely I am rarely able to raid. But the other thing is, I still need to plan something with this person. <laughs> we still need to reschedule something. And I need to talk with them about other things as well. <laughs> I know who we're raiding. Alright, let me get the raid going. And actually, funny enough, we could do the salt raid again. <laughs> we could do the salt raid again. <laughs> you know what? We're doing the salty raid again. They're playing they're playing a salty game. They're, they're being salty. Let's let's do a salty raid. But uh but yeah, we're just gonna we're just gonna do this. We're just gonna make it small, you know. We're gonna make it small. Um I won't add the, the salt and stuff like that. As you can tell, I am very much tired. I I I need to go. <laughs> I need to go. Uh, let me see. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> Thankfully their name is unique enough. Anyways. I know who we're gonna raid. I'll just start the raid. Um, but yeah. Next week, charity stream, charity event is beginning. We're gonna be doing that. Um... We're gonna ha we have donos. We have a whole bunch of other things that we're gonna be doing. Um, so so yeah. So these are all the charity incentives right now. I can't show you all the donation goal stuff because some of it is a little bit a spoiler of what the two point or, or the new um, model that I'm debuting is gonna look like. Um, it's just gonna be fun. It's gonna be hilarious, and that that's all that matters. We're having fun, um, and. <laughs> There will be certain uh, things, like if we reach our goal of 300, every 100 after that, um, I will make like a new goal um, that I will have to do. Um, I'm going to try and make it not too outrageous and something that I could probably be feasibly able to do um, and just kind of have, have fun with it. Um, but anyways, without any further ado, as I always say, may the winds guide you all until next time. Goodbye, everybody.